Hey all, so it's uh, Friday, I'm doing the commute to work, um, something that I don't want to be doing for the rest of my life and the and, and reason why I'm doing this video, I was just driving along thinking, surely all these people in their cars can't love what they do that much to want to do it for the rest of their life. Like, unless the lady in the BMW in front of me has got a hell of a lot of coin and she owns a business and she doesn't have to do anything, well, okay, fair enough, but surely there's not that many people out there. I know the guy driving past in that Mack truck would rather get up in the morning and not go to work, surely. Like, how many people out there, if they be real with themselves, enjoy getting up and going to work? I know that a lot of people say, no, I enjoy my job and, you know, I like the people that I work with and blah, blah, blah. But at the end of the day, I know if I turn around and said to you, I'll give you 10 grand a week to do whatever you want if you quit your job, I'm pretty sure you'd quit your job. Um, and there will be, uh, I'm not saying not everyone, but there will be, you know, the odd, what, 2% two percent of people that that'll say no i enjoy my job but i want the 10 grand a week you know which is cool you know good for you you're one of the lucky few but that leaves like 98 percent of us and like i don't know if these are the right figures i'm just what i believe surely it's about 98 percent but that leaves 98 percent of us get up in the morning and go to work just so we can pay the bills like wouldn't you rather stay home and do what you want and you know, do something you enjoy while your bills are getting paid. No, it's sort of hard to understand. And you can't tell people, you can't tell people this because so many people are anti-network marketing. It's a pyramid scheme, blah, 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 blah. You know, come on, man, wake up and smell the roses. You're, um, you're stuck in a life that's getting controlled by somebody else. And quite frankly, you know, you're no different to anybody else out there. I'm no different to now a man in front of me in a Mercedes Benz. You know, he's probably just going to work, probably thinking the same thing. Oh, I wish I didn't have to go to work today. I can't wait for the end of the day, weekend, tomorrow. You know, how do we get you people out there to believe that and understand that there is a better way? I don't know. You know, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna preach to you that there's a better way. One day you'll realise, and probably when you're old, that you missed out on so much life because of work, and then you'll be the one kicking yourself because you'll be sorry that your life has just passed you by and you're about to die, and you haven't done really anything. You had to ask for your four weeks off every year just so you can make something of your life so you can tell your kids yeah I went to America or yeah I went I went around the world or I went on a cruise and I done this it's like yeah you done that for four weeks man for the other 48 weeks you worked your ass off to pay for that four weeks you know and you know I'm in the same boat right now so I'm not saying I'm any better than anybody else the difference between me and most people is I'm trying to get off the boat I'm trying to get out. I'm trying to get out of the game and into a new game, a game that will that will pay me a residual income for staying home and doing what I want. So, all of you out there that that um, are happy with their jobs, yep, sweet, good for you, congratulations. All of you that are not, that are in the same position as me, drive to work on a Friday, hanging out for the end of the day to have a couple of beers and see the weekend. Think about what you're doing, because. You know, it's probably something that you've been doing for a long time already and it's going to be something that you're going to keep on doing for a long time until you retire with probably not enough money to live a good life in your retirement you have just enough money to retire and and see out the last 20 years or if that and then die um, so to you people think about it that's, that's all I ask it doesn't have to be the business I'm in or you know the business that your friends are in look for something Look for something that's going to help you enjoy your life a lot more and, and get out of this 9 to 5 game where you have to go work for somebody else. Live your life on your own terms.
live it by your own design. Yeah? Sure. Boom.